What's happening guys? I'm back with another update. My weight is still going down as always. I'm almost down 13 kilos already and I'm feeling better than I have been for a long time and more energetic and leaner of course. I would have to guess I'm about 15% body fat at the moment. And for guys who don't know, I'm a short guy, so I'm 171 centimeters tall, or about 5 foot 7 and a half, so I don't belong in the heavier weight classes anyway, unless I want to, to really bulk up and go full fat mode, but I just trained through another RP 10 week of fives, and still goes to show that I haven't lost that much strength a few reps here and there, I don't think that's really anything to complain about considering I lost a substantial amount of weight already so I'm actually looking forward to another hypertrophy block which won't come really yet but as I'm making this video I'm 9 weeks out from a test and I have one more strength block and then a peaking block ending with the test and I'm planning on dieting until my picking block starts then I bump up to maintenance and my plan is to to switch to the power building AI after the test for a few blocks um, to switch it up and to put on some more mass I'll be in a, a slight surplus during that time after that I'm most likely to switch back to the powerlifting AI. When I'm done dieting I'll also hopefully make a body transformation video, a short little update on on my weight loss journey for the two months being. And as I mentioned in the title of this video, I've tried playing around with my sumo deadlift a bit. A few singles here and there, different intensities, and I have to say it feels much better and it's more smooth than my conventional at this body weight for some reason. So I'm really considering switching to sumo, even though I'm nine weeks out from my test. And I feel it's time to switch because my sumo feels almost effortless compared to my conventional at the same weight. So. Also, I'm putting up this clip of me doing a sumo, a spontaneous sumo deadlift for four plates after squat and bench and the day after the RP10 deadlift. So, have a look. Still some technique and a few things to, to tweak, but I'm really considering switching. I'm making my sumo my my preferable stance. I just trained through an RP10 week and I was maybe too ambitious again trying to hit hit weights that I wasn't sure I will be making but I'd rather go for more to see if I can make it than just choose a weight that I know I can make, especially on these RP10 test weeks. But as I am in a color deficit, I'm not surprised that my strength doesn't go up or at all. So that's it for this video and I'll be finishing up showing you what I have been doing for the last few weeks. Until next time, make some gains.
Told only by frozen memories